Hey guys, we are live. How you guys doing today? What's going on in your area? You know, today's a kind of a gloomy day, but pretty warm outside. So I just figured I'd come out, see what's going on, check out, check out everybody. Yeah, had a had a good day so far. It's lunchtime right now, so you know. Just go outside, check it out. So I went out and found found it pretty nice outside. So I'm just out killing time, looking at what's going on, looking at all the trees. A lot of the trees, the leaves are changing. So yeah, I, I wanted to uh, try out some new things today on on this. I want to see if um if I flip it like this, will it still will it still be um going live? So right now I'm, I'm just trying to see um how far I can go and and still go live. So that's what I'm doing. I'm just out. Messing around, looking around. I do go outside. <laughs> you know. Life is what you make of it, you know. Um, sometimes people want to bitch and complain about life and woe is me and how come... How come he got more cereal and how come pink is my favorite color? You know, does anybody really care? Seriously, nobody gives a shit if you got more cereal. <laughs> you know, just put everything aside. Hey, Emmy. You know I'm outside. I'm trying to find the uh, um, distance from my Wi-Fi to the house. I am halfway up the road to the driveway, and the house is right there. The lake is behind us. So right now I'm just out checking the. Uh, how far we could walk around and um, stay in signal. But right now it's pretty good, it's around 50 yards. <coughs> Should have um, used my asthma medicine, but before I left. But it's all good. Got a lot of big ass trees everywhere. So I'm just out. Seeing what's going on. Take a look at the plants, trees. Always got, always got something to do. Hey Gypsy, how you doing today, man? How are all you guys doing? You know, get out, enjoy life. Don't just always do nothing. Just go out and enjoy what you have. Be grateful that it's a beautiful day out and you're out having a good time. You don't got to go out and spend a lot of money. Just go out, enjoy your, enjoy your environment. You know, it's always nice. Over here is my aunt's 
beehives. We got another one over here by the house. But yeah, we're back by the house. Easier going downhill than going uphill. <laughs> Sometimes it's an ongoing battle, life. Life has its ups and downs. Take advantage of, take advantage of both, you know. Sometimes if we have down days, we learn to respect our good days. These are sure pretty plants. We got bushes all over the place. Yeah. We have a pretty good property line. The lake is behind us. My, one of my cousin's projects, having a vegetable garden. This is my aunt's project, is the, is the beehive, honeybees. Take a seat, take a, take a look at them. Let's go up close. They're not messing with me because I'm not messing with them. That's how life is, you know? You know, you don't, don't, don't stir it. Don't poke the bees. They're not gonna bother you. Just like life, you irritate somebody, they're gonna, they're gonna come and get you. <laughs> but if you just keep a distance and respect, they're gonna respect you, you know? I ain't wearing no suit. And I'm right here at, at arm's length, but they, they ain't bothering me because I ain't messing with them. I'm not afraid. <laughs> so yeah, just out, just out, have a good time. You know, that's all, just out, have a good time. Don't, don't mess with nobody. Don't get envious of him or her. Uh, 19 years, yeah. I got bees everywhere right now. <laughs> Am I crazy? Yeah. But again, like I said, just don't, don't irritate, and just, just let, let it happen. Um, next year, we just, my aunt just opened these up. This is our first summer having bees. This is our first summer here. Um, cause we came from last year, we came here. Okay, why? Why? Cause I'm not messing with them. <laughs> They're everywhere though. You know, if you're, if you're afraid of everything, then yeah, you know, the bees are gonna see you being afraid and they gonna, they gonna um, get you. But if you're not afraid and you're not a threat, they're not gonna mess with you. Just like regular people, you know. But yeah, this is my, my out walking around, seeing what's going on. The bees have a everyday um, supply of nectar, you know. Nectar's pretty cool. I learned the other day, I thought, you know, we see bees, we take bees for granted, and we, we think bees, we think honey. Uh, I was told if there was no bees on the planet, we would all die. We would starve to death because the bees pollinate all the um, vegetables and fruit, and they um, activate the other plants. Um, and make them grow and bear fruit. So I thought that was kind of cool. I think everybody likes honey. 
We all, we all need some kind of honey in our lives. Yeah. I'm just out walking around and enjoying the day. Everybody's inside or they're outside. My cousin's, he's out working on his um, tractor for the, for the grass cutting. Yeah. Just out, just out having a good time. We're, we're around seven minutes out of town. No, not seven minutes. But it's around, it's around 10 minutes out of town. Hey, Victor. How you doing, man? Hey, is that you, Ray? <laughs> How you doing, buddy? Yeah, just out. My diet's going pretty good. You know, I thought I wasn't going to notice about my weight loss, but not too bad. Just out. If you have a goal, and then if you try to make a reach reach your goal, then it's easier to do. But if you have a like a crazy goal, and sometimes you're not gonna be able to reach your goal because it's too far, too far fetched. But if you start with small goals, then you work your way up, and eventually you'll get to your goal. Am I happy? Um, I'm always happy, you know. There, there's nothing to be unhappy about. I'm, I'm away from my family, so yes, I'm, un, I'm unhappy about that. But, you know, sooner or later, uh, they could come here. Um, I did the paperwork, and they, they, they can just come here when they get legal age. They already can get their uh, passport. They are dual citizen by birth. So they can have either passport, but they do got to uh, surrender one passport. When they hit 18, then they had to give up the uh, U.S. passport or they had to give up the um, Philippine passport. So we, we are lucky that way that my kids isn't really bound to one passport right now. But they had the luxury of having both passports. Um, yeah, but you know, it's just a beautiful day. Uh, we got we got neighbors, we got neighbors on uh, across the lake right here and down down the road. And their houses, I think my aunt's house is pretty cool. But this house uh, right here across the lake. Uh, that's a, like a multi-million dollar estate, and <laughs> all, all, there's so many houses around here that they all got, you know, big claims and stuff, so it, it's, it's kind of funny. And then we come in, and my aunt, my aunt's just a, she retired school teacher, and my uh, my uncle is a retired uh, program operator, and my my cousin went in went in his father's footsteps and followed him um, into taking doing uh, that kind of lifestyle. But yeah, just out. See, right now my um, everything is diagonal. Okay. So hopefully, hopefully um, later when I go in the house and I uh, put it on YouTube, right now we're on YouTube Live, um, so hopefully it's going to look good. But yesterday when I went and did this and, the, and I was holding the, uh, the camera diagonal and it looked like it was supposed to be horizontal. We get I I went out of buffer 
so right now I'm just out finishing my walk around. Pretty nice. Got a lot of work, <laughs> a lot of work on doing upkeep. Um, landscape kind of works, yard works. There, there's literally lots of things you can do all the time, every day here, just to, just to stay busy. Sometimes too much work and, and you feel, sometimes you feel a little bit overwhelmed. That's a pretty cool flower, huh? Yeah, just a nice place, peace and quiet. Um, yes, yeah, a, lot, a lot of boring. But it's kind of relaxing. You don't have a, you don't have a, you know, um, what do you call it? Neighbors that are bothering you. They're, they're pretty cool. We, we got a whole bunch of neighbors, but we have a lot of heavy tree line. We have a heavy tree line all over the property, so it's it's kind of a little bit. Um, we have a lot of privacy because of the trees. Now I'm in the back. Yeah, I'm in the back. This is our deck. We got a third, third, third story part of the house. I'm just out letting you guys see what's see what's happening. Hope you guys are enjoying your lunchtime, my lunchtime. Rained out a little bit last night, but that's okay. Our Next door neighbor, he's a doctor. Um, he's he's from India, but he's a big time doctor here, and he he got a nice house too. And they're they're doing some kind of construction work that they're going to be doing pretty soon. Yeah, there's always something going on around here. And. Figured I'd let you guys come out, take a look at what's going on. I got a little battery coming. Let's take a look at the lake. Here it is. It's a decent size. It's a, it's a really, it's like a um, drinking water quarry. It's a man-made lake. And it, the, the lake's open to the public. They do have fish that they stock here, and bass, and so I guess maybe trout. And this is the only um, electric motor lake. So. I hope you guys kind of enjoyed my little, little walk around and, you know, it's just nice to get out of the house. I just. Well, I'm, I'm not proving to you guys that I that I I get up and move around, but see, I'm not in front of the computer, and but I'm doing a live cast. But <laughs> you know, you you can do a live cast anywhere you go. <laughs> oh shit! Hey, I had a good time last night, and I I got I got some guests coming up. Uh, one is from. Um, Australia next week and I got another one that I'm trying to work with get a schedule and he's from South Africa um, I, I, I want to try to um, 
do this interviewing thing because, I mean, instead of having the same people um, come on, I have an open door. If you want to come on, you can come on. Um, I think a lot of people like that, having multiple people on the show at the same time, giving their point of view and just their outlook. And I like it. Probably you guys like it too. <laughs> you know, I mean, what's not to like? You know, I can't see. I, I, I know you guys are doing uh, writing down stuff, but I can't see up close. Um, maybe I could I could catch. Okay, I, I can, but I, I have to wait a little bit. But yeah. Yeah, Bob, Bob Cooper, um, I, I was giving him a hard time last night, but it was a playful hard time, and I, I, hope, I hope he enjoyed me um, messing with him. He, he seems like um, he's a pretty cool guy, and he's going to go out. He's the one that went out with um, Santai 7, um, and they had pizza, and... Now I guess next, uh, maybe in a week or so, he's going to go have, have dinner again with them. They want to go out and have, have dinner. So that, that sound, sounds kind of fun, you know. Yeah, get out. Um, go try new foods. Have a little talk, you know, maybe talk to the manager. Tell him you're gonna give him a plug, and maybe that he can give you a deal, you know, on the food and stuff. You know, you don't you don't know until you try it. So don't be afraid to ask. Don't be afraid to um, do stuff. Because all you got, I mean, you got two answers. Yes, that's no problem. Or no, and that's still no problem. But it doesn't hurt to ask. So just go out. Enjoy life. Don't don't be a don't be a hermit. Don't be a hater. You know, I mean, if somebody's better than you, hats off. You know, you de they deserve it. But hey, I like Ren. He don't bother me. I don't bother him. You know, there ain't nothing wrong with him. Or any of these other guys, you know, it just, you know, you, you like, you, you have, everybody has their own likes, their own personalities, and, just, I mean, everybody, if everybody had the same actions and the same personality, then everybody's going to be pretty damn boring. Uh, I'm, I'm trying to see what you're saying. Why are you guys so... No, 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 he, like I said, he's pretty cool. I like Jay. There's a lot of people that are pretty cool that, I mean... But we're not all obsessed. <laughs> That's kind of messed up thinking. Um, no! But I, I would like to go, I would like to go back. Um, there's always something going on in Anchorage, going on in, in Alaska. Um, Alaska is a pretty exciting place to go to for, for um, sport, meaning um, um, hunting, fishing, or work. So yeah, that's that's pretty cool. Northway Mall. <laughs> that's on the other. I I usually went to the Diamond Center. <laughs> I, I like the Diamond Center because we don't live that far from the airport. Um, my my parents, my grandparents. Uh, so we always went. Uh, plus, I went to Diamond High School back in the '80s. Um, I graduated in in 1980, and. 
Yeah, the Diamond Center, that's a pretty cool place to, to do everything. Fishing in Kenai on the Russian, Russian River. Yeah. Yeah, uh, but we would go from, from Anchorage to Anchor Point, and then from Anchor Point to Homer, and then um, come back to um, Anchor Point and go over to Clam Gulch and go, uh, go get clams. We got some pretty big Razorback clams. And then after that, then we would go and stop at the Russian River. That's the Kenai. Same thing. And then go fishing and then go home. But we would take the whole weekend, sometimes the holidays, and, and go out there. So, yeah. Yeah, Homer, good for halibut. <laughs> yeah, yeah, it is. Yeah, it is. Homer, Homer is a pretty cool place. I told you I unblocked you. <laughs> I, I don't, I don't, you know, if, if people irritate me or, or accidentally um, get blocked, um, if it's accidentally, I deeply apologize because that, that's, you know, but accidents do happen. But, yeah. You know, it's out, out and do things and go places, do things. Try different foods, try different languages if you can, if you can remember, you know. This side's here, my aunt's side of the house, and then this side here is my cousin's side of the house, and then downstairs is my side of the house. And then down below, I don't know if you can see it. We get we got a dock. There it is. Don't know if I can zoom in. Okay, yeah. But there's our dock, and we got all kinds of things going on down there. Our next door neighbor's house. Our other neighbor. We got neighbors <laughs> every everywhere, but you just don't really see them. But they're there. There we go. Yeah, I just wanted to come on for a little while. My battery on my phone is being eaten up. But I just want to come out and say, hey, see how you guys doing? Enjoying your lunch? It's around 12, 12.54 Central Time, Kentucky Time, and I just wanted to come on and say, hey, Maybe I'll come on tonight. Maybe not. We'll see. We'll see what's going to happen. Um, just be be safe. Have fun. Ah, okay. Long Beach, huh? That sounds kind of nice. All right, you guys. I'll talk to you guys later on. Have fun. Be safe. And I'm out of here. Let me try to turn this off without. There we are. Uh, well, I wanna.